Hi, my name is Dave Andrews, and today I'm going to show you how to troubleshoot a computer hard drive. Let's go to our computer, and we're going to run a checking program that will check a computer hard drive for problems. Just click on your start button, and on XP, you'll go to run. I'm just going to type in CMD here, which you would type in the XP run prompt. Now on Vista, let's right click on command and say run as administrator. Hit press continue. Now we're going to run a, uh, a function here that will, or a program that will check the entire uh, hard drive in our computer for problems and will uh, fix those problems as it encounters them. Uh, the way that it will fix them is it will basically mark any bad sectors that it comes across and it won't use those bad sectors in the future. So let's type chkdsk for check disk, sort of shorthand there, and then a space slash F for fix any problems that you come across. Press enter after typing that. And it's going to tell you it can't run right now because uh, we're basically using our hard drive. So what it wants you to do is it wants you to reboot your computer and then while your computer is booting back up it's going to run that uh, troubleshooting test on it. So we're going to say Y for yes, uh, which means we want it to run the next time the computer restarts. And we're going to say enter. So basically we've just flagged our hard drive to be checked the very next time this computer restarts. So click on your uh, start button and basically go to this little arrow and we'd like to choose restart to restart our computer. My name is Dave Andrews and I've just showed you how to troubleshoot a hard drive.